Hey guys, uh, welcome back. Uh, in this video, I mainly want to showcase the wireless communication class notes uh, from Professor Dr. Aditi K. Javanathan, sir, from IIT Kanpur. Okay, so what all things would be covered as part of this uh, notes is introduction to MIMO, zero forcing receiver, MMSC receiver, power allocation using water filling, spatial multiplexing, uh, introduction to space time clock code, all multi code, and uh, maximum like you decoder and we blast to receiver so let me showcase the notes uh, um, so this is the notes uh, this is the part 4 this this part is actually very much important uh, uh, because it covers uh, the major concepts like MIMO and various receivers uh, so let me go through the initial part is related to the introduction of uh, MIMO So for various conditions of uh, receive and transmit antenna, the MIMO things uh, are uh, displayed. Yeah, things are uh, repeated uh, in the next class. So example uh, for precast to case, what is the error vector? Okay, based on error vector, how we can derive the least square solution using the principle of path variety. So these uh, so some more items uh, have been taught in the class. So these I have captured extra based on whatever sir was explaining beer of a MIMO system so first using zero forcing solution so many things I have actually written in the pencil they are not captured very well but those are also very much important if you are able to see that okay exact beer equation So few things are repeated. What will be the diversity in case of uh, zero percent receiver? So that is given over here and probability of uh, error equation. Okay, moving ahead with uh, MIMO MMSC. So, initially, this is the derivation. So, you can refer this derivation for some of the interviews uh, for system engineering profile. So, under the 1TX antenna. And the uh, MMSC would reduce to MRC, and if there is an ISNR, then it will reduce to zero forcing receiver. So, next is SVD so, when the number of receiver antenna is greater than transmit antenna. So, important properties similar values, okay, example. Examples of how to perform SVD is given over here. This is a very much important property. Um, so you can note down that HH emission. If you perform, then you will get uh, U sigma square U emission. You will form the eigenvectors of HH emission. Okay. So few things will be repeated in the next class for the sake of uh, better understanding. What happens if some uh, eigenvalues are, uh, are uh, 
similar values of our zeros. The concept of a special multiplexing or a parallel channels. So maximum sum rate uh, problem and uh, it is converted to convex optimization problem and a water filling problem has been explained. So this is a water filling problem. So based on water filling problem uh, example is taken over here. So now we are coming to space time block code or basically automotive code. So holomotic is uh, how the symbols are transmitted at the time instance t is equal to 1 and t is equal to 2 and we are able to achieve the orthogonality along the columns of H matrix. Yeah, Halmuti is a full rate, uh, full diversity scheme. Uh, so one more time in the next class, the Halmuti codes have been taught uh, to understand, uh, to get the understanding, to get the better understanding. Two cross two MIMO maximum like you the decoder. So I mean how to perform the decoding. So now it is generalized for hot cross two MIMO maximum like you decoder. If you can see these things uh, in the pencil, um, th those are all the important things. Uh, so just to try to go through. V blast receiver. Okay, so here assignment number four discussion is started and that is related to one first question related to CDM, CDMA. So from here, next uh, question started. That is also, I think, related to CDMA. Question number five over here.
okay at the end we have a MIMO beamforming this is the last concept I believe so depending upon uh, the transmit direction V and receive direction U uh, the beamforming uh, is done okay transmit beamforming is done that is what is uh, showcased uh, over here so if we take max SNR and uh, this is coming to be this particular uh, format H emission H as we can as we have seen uh, that forms the maximum eigen value so it's like if you are beamforming along the maximum eigen value of H emission H so it's like a eigen based beamforming concept so from here the eigen based beamforming concept has been derived Okay, so till this point, uh, quiz 2 was uh, considered. Uh, thank you very much. Please do subscribe to the channel. Share with uh, people who are uh, in need of uh, such notes and such concepts. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Bye-bye.